Have you been working on your Mac for a while and connected to many different wireless networks that you don't need to see anymore? Well, how do we get rid of those? Well, we'll show you next right here. All right, over the years, I've actually worked on many different wireless networks using my Mac, and those have also transferred over as I've even continued to upgrade on the operating system itself. Well, how do we get rid of those things? It's relatively simple here. So what we're going to do is we are going to look for the Wi-Fi connection in the upper right-hand corner on our taskbar up here. And if I select that, I can then go down to open network preferences. So you do see the list of them here, but these are all the current ones that are active right around our building. So I'm gonna click on open network preferences. When I do that, I wanna verify that we have Wi-Fi selected. Then we're gonna click on advanced. Now underneath the advanced, you have networks that are showing up here in this list that you haven't connected to for in a, you haven't connected to in a while. So for example, I can select this option here and simply go ahead and remove that by clicking on the minus sign and then select remove. And notice it tells you that, hey, uh, the, your Mac and other devices using the iCloud keychain will no longer join this Wi-Fi network. So if you want to make sure of that, you can simply remove that. That's one option that you have to be able to do so. Then you'll click OK and apply. And once that's applied, you can close out of that as well. And that should ensure that that wireless network will not show back up until you go near that network again and you choose to join it. Well, if you want to learn more about Apple, of course, uh, make sure you check out the IT Pro TV website, but also make sure you subscribe, of course, to our YouTube channel by hitting the subscription button or notifications if you want to see this content as it actually is posted. Well, thank you for watching.